What up, YouTube HVAC fan? I'm gonna do something a little bit different. Um, we've been warm the last few days in the 60s. A little cooler out this morning. Actually, just driving to my first call. Picked up a smoke detector. Got the smoke detector in. Um, thought I'd try something different. Just to kind of do a true vlog in between the stuff I can record, the stuff I can't record, the stuff you guys don't see. Uh, give you a little inside baseball. We'll, maybe we'll call it call it inside HVAC. Uh, just kind of show you what I'm doing. The non-interesting stuff, the little tedious stuff, and some of the things that we do in between the stuff that you guys actually see. Um, so we'll see how it goes. Uh, this will be the first one, and I'm just going to record over a week or so and try to throw something together and see how interesting it is and see what you guys think. So, we'll see how this goes. If you're seeing this, then maybe I got something for you. Maybe I had nothing for you, so you're getting this. didn't work out we're pulling out now um, smoke detectors in the space tenants not here they didn't communicate building owner didn't communicate with the tenant to tell them they needed to be here so I wasted an hour of Friday I got like seven more to go hopefully we'll see how that works out but uh, we're on our way to the next one this is the stuff you guys don't see um, I gotta drive across town and reset some steam humidifiers that are just going to lock out again but they need humidity and we've been telling them for months and months we got to change the canisters the canisters are all ate up and here we are going out there every week a couple times to reset their humidifiers so it's going to fall on me today so we're going to go uh reset some power and make sure things come back on and then see what else we got going on on friday so Those two guys there, hydromatics. Those two guys there were running. I'm dumping this one right now. Water coming out over there in the drain. Um, these things are from Germany. So it was like two weeks out on the damn canisters. This one wasn't running. We had all question marks. So. Um, had this issue before I can't get you a good look at that but uh, I, we can't get an answer from hydromatic on why we get question marks you reset it and I'm reading 25% now oh there you go so I don't know where my question marks come from it's got all my values in here and Everything was reading question marks, set, all output, all this stuff. So um, we're gonna let this one go. We'll watch it for a little while, but that's where I'm at. Um, got a couple boilers, vacuum pumps, all kinds of good stuff in here. Water softener back there. Water softener does not feed the steam humidifiers. That would cause a problem. And it looked like pretty clean water coming out. We've cleaned them out periodically over the last few months as we were trying to get them to make a move on the canisters. So, still waiting on canisters. We'll do what we can here. So we're gonna be good in here. We're gonna go on to the next one. If y'all don't have one of these, go get one. They're freaking amazing. Every commercial guy ought to have one. They work out great. It's called the door jam. HVAC Tactical. So we're wrapping that one up. Uh, getting ready to... Well, I'm going to pedal around for a little bit and maybe grab a bite to eat. Early lunch. We got to go over and help one of the installers. Or at least he's going to show me where everything's at. Sounds like we're just going to braze a few lines in and pull a vacuum. It's a little time and material job. So see how that goes. He's got a little bit before he's going to be there. So... We'll uh, get over there and see what we got. Go from there. Maybe we can 
milk the rest of our Friday out doing that. Have at it again Monday. You can't really film in here, but this is what they wanted me to braise. I thought it was going to be a whole lot easier than this, but chiller shipped in two parts. So our receiver here, we've got connections, and then I've got two large pipes coming from here to here, and then my liquid line from there to there. And pull the vacuum. Let's see how this goes. I think the compressors are isolated. We got semi hermetics. Pretty sure they're isolated with all the refrigerant in the compressor, so keep on going. Even ship with brazen rods. How about that? We're gonna set up the braze. They are coming out the suction side, so. This one's actually got refrigerant in it. They're too isolated. I'm not sure what they're exactly doing. Some kind of chamber, test chamber or something. Uh, manufacturer's here with me, doesn't know a whole lot. He's calling people to try to find how much refrigerant this thing even takes. But it's a separate circuit on the chamber on this side, so they had to cut it out to ship it for some reason. So I got everything cleaned up and I'm gonna go braze. Pull a vacuum and we'll weigh whatever they in, they say, and. But they gotta take care of it. This is just time and material. They sent somebody that couldn't braze apparently. It's how it be sometimes. Cap tubes here. Not the most beautiful braze joints, but they're holding. Looking good so far. Still haven't answered any questions on how much refrigerant this holds. It looks like 404A on this side is charged. It's R32 for the other stage. So this is all discharged with 404A. On the other side, it comes in, there's a coil on top here, the condenser coil for the R32 side. It's just an interesting setup. All right, so I got a little more of the story. It's not really what I had in mind when I was sent to go raise in a line set. But uh, chiller I was working on, looks like it's a chamber of some sort. <clears throat> uh, circuit I was working on was R32 as I was pressure testing and ran out of nitrogen the guy handed me uh, what he said was a nitrogen tank was actually R32 so that's what we're supposed to put in the compressor after I get an evacuation on it they wanted a 24 hour pressure test so it's holding pressure right now everything looks good on that end he couldn't tell me the weight either as I asked how much how much are we supposed to put in this uh, I think 42 <laughs> I need something a little more concrete than I think 42 so he's getting back with the manufacturer he's supposed to start this thing up I don't know how that's gonna go but that's not my problem I was just supposed to brace it in pull a vacuum and charge it so we'll come back on Monday and uh, finish up on that but this was just a little bit different of a video this might have been something I posted pictures on Instagram or something I thought this might be kind of interesting, so y'all have to let me know what you think. Uh, give me some questions or something that I can answer in these uh, drives in between calls and all this little stuff that I deal with every day. So, something a little different. Leave me a comment. Leave the trade better than you found it. Let me know what y'all think about this. We'll see you guys on the next one.